Last reason I'm going to tell you. Who knows the first two laws that Hitler implemented? Hitler, first two laws that Hitler implemented that not only not only put him in a different status than everybody else for the rest of history, but also made what's called until this day the biggest financial miracle in history. Who knows the first two laws? Before the Nuremberg laws. Before that, we're talking about years before it. Hitler first comes into power. What's the first two laws? Okay, I'll save you the time. Rule number one. No more pornography. No more homosexuality. None of that garbage. Not allowed. Berlin, in the 30s, in the 20s, was the Sodom and Gomorrah of the day. They were the Las Vegas of the day. They were the Sodom and Gomorrah of the day. Homosexuality, pornography, all the bestiality, all the garbage of the world, that was the capital of the world. He outlawed it. You're no longer allowed. Closed all the bars, all the gay clubs, all the production, which were all run by Jewish people. Unfortunately. Second rule. What's the second rule? Second rule was, you're not allowed to charge interest. No more interest. Now you would think, why? What does he care about interest? Well, because all the people that had the money, that lent the money out, were Jews. He didn't like it. So he said no more interest. Why? Because of the high interest that the Jews charged people was so high, it ruined, it destroyed the economy in Germany. They destroyed, just like they destroyed Russia a few years before that through their communism over there. Jews destroyed Russia. Not, uh, not going. Jews destroyed. Communism is by Jews. Well, don't let anybody confuse you. You look at history, Karl Marx, all the other Rishayim, they're all Jews. Wicked, but nonetheless Jews. They destroyed Russia, and he wrote in chapter 2 of Mein Kampf, they destroyed Russia, now they want it, they're destroying uh, Germany, that's why I have to destroy them. Allahu Akbar, Allah.